Plastic and styrofoam are all around us. We use it on a daily basis. However, our dependency on these non-biodegradable materials and the lack of properly disposing of these products have become a serious problem. The goal is to reduce plastic and styrofoam pollution by April 22, 2019. This will be done through a phasing out of single-use plastic shopping bags, styrofoam and plastic food utensils. There is a lot of uh, dependency on, in country on, on these um, products. Um, but there is also a lot of concern of the pollution they cause um, on our side of the highways, in waterways, in our rivers and, and the Caribbean Sea. And so the um, phasing out would involve uh, a series of steps. The first being public awareness um, of, of the importance of this step and the government has decided. Um, and also an engagement of those stakeholders who are involved in the industrial sector and those stakeholders who use these products. Um, besides you and me every day who go to the store and, and buy stuff and use these products, there are people who, um, who also um, import these and then distribute. According to the CEO and the Ministry of Fisheries, Forestry, the Environment and Sustainable Development, Dr. Percival Shaw, these materials will not be allowed to be imported. And in terms of the actual phasing out, um, the instrument that, that is going to be used is simply a, 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 a ban on the importation of these items um, uh, within a year. So we don't generally um, make a lot of these items. Some some is made locally, but in terms of the majority of the plastic bags, that they're imported. No? Um, and so if we don't want them on the market, then it's simply a matter of not importing it into the country. The CEO says that the alternative to styrofoam plates and single-use plastic bags are already available. The alternative um, products on the market, they're already there, but that they will... Um, uh, be uh, phased in in terms of uh, a lowering of, of duty on these products, which also cabinet had, had approved yesterday, um, that that be looked at, so that you you simply then would have the effect of replacing one product for the next within within the course of the year. The news of government's decision to reduce plastic and styrofoam pollution by Earth Day 2019 was welcomed by Oceana Belize. Nineteen percent of what's in the municipal um, garbage stream. Are these items uh, we know that has an impact, therefore, not only on what you're seeing um, on the highway or on the in the rivers uh, or on the coast and, and keys when, when you're walking around, but that also has um, in, uh, impact on things like our landfill at, at mile 25. Does that take down the life of the of the landfill and what type of implications do we have there? So I think that. Um, the time frame, we can make the most of it. And I think, you know, this is where we can really um, show that um, this has, you, you'll see on social media, you, you, you certainly see in the press, there is tremendous national support for this. So I'm, I'm confident that that time frame is not unrealistic for us to make significant progress on implementing this phase out. Reporting for Love News, Hippolyta Novello.